often you hear the comment or the phrase living on purpose and aligning your life with your purpose, oneself with your purpose. And as a, a caregiver, we know one of your purpose, you're clearly in alignment through your behavior, your actions, and how you go about, go about living your life. What would you say to individuals who are struggling with, with this, this concept of purpose? How do they align self with purpose? Any recommendations? Well, the way I do it is I, I know that ultimately, our purpose here is tied into God's purpose for our lives. That's what I believe. So in order for me to thoroughly understand what my purpose is, then I believe that the shortest cut for me to do that, instead of just trying to figure it out on my own, I go directly to the source. And I ask, what would you have me to do? And God is ever present, but he's not going to bring his hands down and heal somebody as far as uh, giving them quality of life or taking them places. He's going to put his people to do that job. So I consider myself a vessel to physically act on his behalf. So he's the creator. He makes things happen. But at the same time, he does it through his people. So I position myself to be one of his vessels. In your circle of friends, do you find that a discussion about purpose is a common thing? Well, uh, very rarely do we speak in those deliberate terms of purpose. But I think as we converse and as we deal with topics that are related to purpose, I believe that most of the friends that I deal with has purpose ever present in their mind, even though we don't deliberately speak about purpose as we are today. I believe that purpose is an ever present existence with most of my friends. So, do you believe that it is important that we we speak about it, that we we'll do it in an active way? Oh, absolutely. I think if we did that, we would be more deliberate in the way we live our lives. We would be more proactive in what we do in behalf of our service to others. I think we will have fewer missed opportunities that our purpose has for us, but sometimes we may miss the mark. But I think if we spoke about it in a deliberate way, I think we'll keep our mind and eyes and consciousness open to it. And I think we'll be more uh, proactive in finding purposes that we are suited to fulfill. And, and I like that you said purposes, because indeed, it's not just one purpose that we serve. There are many purposes. Yes. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm very pleased that you, you again highlighted that point. You're an educator, and you will always be an educator. So do you believe that topic purpose is grounded in our systems in, in schools? Well, not enough. 
I think that could be a feature that would greatly enhance the students. When purpose is spoken in a very deliberate way, awareness is brought to the student as to what purpose is, how purpose works, how purpose can be used in their lives, the impact of their actively, consciously using their purpose to affect the lives of others. I think it would be very productive in a classroom. Thank <laughs> you.